Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So currently on Windows 10 and Windows 11, if you pin and link an app that's been downloaded from the Microsoft Store to your desktop, you get the colored backplate, which doesn't look very nice, especially if you're trying to customize your operating system to maybe a nice, clean, minimal look. Now it seems that Microsoft is finally going to bring clean icons for apps on the desktop into Windows 11. And those are apps that are downloaded from the Microsoft Store. Because in the beta channel ball that rolled out at the end of March to the insiders, Microsoft says, and I'm quoting, it's updated the logic for apps pinned to the desktop so that packaged apps no longer show an accent colored backplate. And in doing this, Microsoft says the icons should be bigger and easier to see. And they mention that please note you may need to create new shortcuts for this to take effect if you already have something on your desktop. Now, just to put this all into context, if I head over to a screen grab provided by Windows Latest, here we can see the snipping tool with the updated background. So it's no longer a colored backplate, but more a translucent, transparent backplate, which I think looks a lot better. So the shortcuts no longer have that backplate and look like any other shortcut. So as an example, in the stable version, if I head to an app or software that is not downloaded from the Microsoft Store, as an example, in this case, Google Chrome, you can see that's what it's going to look like. So it's got that transparent backplate instead of a solid backplate like current Microsoft Store apps. I really think this is a nice move in the right direction and has been a long time coming. And because this change is in the beta channel currently, I think that clean shortcuts will begin rolling out um, across the board to everyone on Windows 11. So that would be Windows 11, 23H2 and 24H2 in the coming weeks. And if I get wind of that, obviously I'll try and keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.